Depression is a very real and serious illness that affects many people nowadays. Now, while the conventional medicine found a few different ways to treat depression, sadly, many people don't respond well to drugs or do, simply don't want to take them. And that's where nootropics come into the game. Hey, what's up, Greg here, the founder of your inception. Welcome to my channel where you can learn top secrets about nootropics. Subscribe below to start your journey. In this video, we're gonna be talking about nootropics for depression. So I've received a lot of questions of different people asking me, hey, Greg, are there any nootropics that can help uh, treat depression or if they can help with symptoms of depression? So if they can help to treat symptoms of depression. And, um, you know, I've done my homework I went you know, through the research and I found a lot of interesting things. Just before I share with you the best nootropics for depression, I wanna share with you something else. So first of all, I know a lot of people that are depressed nowadays and that's a big issue. And a couple of things that depressed people have in common are they cannot focus, they're unmotivated, they're most of the time in a pretty bad or even sad mood. Um, they have issues with motivation, with learning and other cognitive functions. And that's pretty normal for depressed people. That's what usually happens. And as I said before at the beginning of the video, this is a big issue uh, where you know it can be tackled in different ways, but many people search for alternative and more natural ways to treat it. So in this video, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna share with you some of the most effective individual nootropic compounds that can help you treat depression, or at least they can help you treat symptoms of depression. Then. I will uh, tell you the best nootropic stacks that you can buy on the market and that they should definitely help you. Now, before we dive into the topic, just one important thing, all the information I provide is not a medical advice. It is just based on my research and the research of my team. It is my recommendation. And if you are depressed, if you're taking any kind of drugs, uh, then definitely consider talking to your doctor before trying any nootropics. That's, I think, it's really important to know, and that's what I want to share with you at the beginning of the video. So, if you're ready, let's begin. The first topic I want to talk about is L-tyrosine. L-tyrosine is an amino acid, not that important in general, but it plays a few very crucial roles in our bodies. Uh, so, what does it do? It supports adrenal gland function, which produces dopamine, which is one of the important neurotransmitters, and epinephrine. Why I'm talking about neurotransmitters because one of the main reasons why people can be depressed are uh, the imbalances of neurotransmitters in our bodies. So if this happens, and obviously nootropics can help with that, then of course um, you have to find which hormones or which neurotransmitters are causing those issues and how to um, improve uh, their function. And as I said before, L-tyrosine is one of those that can definitely be useful. Now, the recommended daily dosage of L-tyrosine kind of depends from uh, person to person, but my personal opinion is you, you could take somewhere around 100 milligrams per day, start there, see what happens, and then increase or even decrease the dosage. It depends on the effects you're gonna get. Another nootropic I wanna talk about is Bacopa Monieri. Bacopa Monieri is one of my favorite nootropics because this is a adaptogen herb that has been used for centuries uh, in the Ayurveda medicine in the past and then later on and nowadays it is used in many effective, very high quality nootropics and tropic supplements. So what Bacopa does is, this is a um, basically an anti-stress uh, herb it can provide anti-stress benefits, uh, anti-anxiety uh, benefits, basically. And there have been some studies done that show that it can help people who suffer from depression. Now, the recommended daily dosage of Bacopa Monero is around 300 milligrams per day. Uh, but keep in mind, if you're gonna buy an individual compound, please check that it contains at least 50% of the active compounds. Uh, because those are responsible for all the benefits that I just mentioned. Another nootropic I want to talk about is 5-HTP. I'm not sure if, if you heard about it, but this is another amino acid and it is so-called natural antidepressant. As the name says, yeah, it could definitely help uh, people who suffer from depression. The funny thing about 5-HTP is that it directly increases the production of serotonin. Now, serotonin is responsible for mood and stress. And if you have too low levels of serotonin, then you might even suffer from depression or you have some other issues. You're definitely not gonna be in the good mood, basically. 
and 5 HTP can help with that. Now the recommended daily dosage kind of varies from 50 milligrams per day to 3000 milligrams. But if you want to take it every single day for a couple of weeks or even months, then I recommend taking somewhere between 50 milligrams to 500 milligrams per day. As I said before, if you're not sure, consult your doctor who should definitely be able to help you. Another tropic I want to talk about is ginkgo biloba. I'm sure you heard about ginkgo biloba before because it is probably one of the most popular nootropics on the market, definitely one of the most used nootropics on the market. Usually people take it uh, for improving memory, but it is not as effective actually. A lot of brands market it as a very effective memory booster, but what is probably more effective in is to help people who are under severe stress or even suffer from depression. So what Ginkgo does is it increases uh, the blood circulation in the brain, which consequently can increase your concentration as well. The recommended daily dosage is somewhere between 120 to 600 milligrams per day. L-theanine is another nootropic I want to talk about. This is another amino acid, one of my favorite ones. You can get it naturally if you drink green tea because it is found in tea leaves. Uh, usually you can find it in, in green tea or black tea and so on. And it's a very effective nootropic for in increasing your focus, concentration, attention basically and it can also relax you and um, makes you more calm. So this is very effective, especially if you combine it with caffeine, this, this works very well. Now, why is it good for depression? Well, because it kind of supports the production of GABA, serotonin and dopamine, which are three very important neurotransmitters in our brain. The recommended daily dosage kind of varies, but it is up to 250 milligrams per day. By the way, guys, I have revealed seven special secrets about nootropics that no one else will tell you. To get them, download my free handbook below. Another nootropic that I want to talk about is called Mucuna prurians. I'm sorry, guys, for the pronunciation of this one. You can see the name below. Uh, that's a tough name for me, but you're gonna figure out what I'm talking about. So Mucuna prurians uh, is also, has been used in the Ayurveda medicine. It's an adaptogenic herb and a very popular and totally natural um, ingredient basically. Why is it good for people who suffer from depression? Well, because it contains L-DOPA and this is a precursor of dopamine. The recommended daily dosage is somewhere between 200 and 500 milligrams per day. Nupept is another amazing nootropic that I want to talk about. Now, compared to other nootropics on our list, Nupept is basically a synthetic nootropic. It is similar to racetams, actually it's similar to piracetam, but much more potent. And as the research show, it was basically developed to improve the cognitive function, but also to help uh, people who are depressed. It can stimulate both dopamine and serotonin receptors or uh, neurotransmitters. The recommended daily dosage is somewhere between 10 to 20 milligrams and you can take this up to three times per day. Now keep in mind, I'm not such a big fan of Nupip because it is a synthetic compound, but apparently it's very effective, so it's on you to decide. By the way, guys, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. Use a hashtag AskYourInception and I will weekly answer some of the most interesting questions that I will receive. Last but not least, let's talk about St. John's Wort. I'm not sure if you heard about this one before. This is a medicinal plant that is used for different stuff, but in general, it can help people who are under severe stress it works for uh, reducing anxiety or it is useful for that and it can also treat mild depression. The recommended daily dosage is somewhere around 300 milligrams per day and you can take this up to three times. All right guys, so we just covered the most potent individual compounds, natural nootropics. Okay, there was no in it, but apart from that, mainly natural nootropics that can help you treat symptoms of depression or at least what we found, what my team found and I found and the studies show they are very effective in doing that. Now, you can buy each individual compound separately, or you can buy a couple of uh, nootropic compounds separately, try them at home, see what happens. As I said before, this is not a medical device, so consult your doctor before doing that. But there's one other way you can do, instead of buying individual compounds separately, you can buy a nootropic supplement. A nootropic supplement is basically a product that contains uh, many nootropics compound, and actually there are some very effective nootropic supplements on the market that I would personally use to treat symptoms of depression. Now, we have a very developed system, very advanced system for measuring different nootropic supplements and we are constantly optimizing those lists so we can always recommend the best nootropic sector that we believe um, will definitely help you the most. 
if you want to learn more about them, there are links below. Check it out. You're going to find my favorite nootropic supplement for improving depression or helping people treat symptoms of depression. And I'm pretty sure you're going to find something for you that's going to work well, something to experiment with. And based on the results so far, I have many stories I can share with you from people who actually had a severe depression and now, as according to them, they feel much, much better. Okay, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me. Don't forget subscribing on my channel. Don't forget following Your Inception on Facebook and Instagram. And I hope to see you soon, guys.